hello friends today i will discuss about use of uh, capacitor bank operating 20 mbr that is 20 megahertz of 33 kb system voltage in a substation before going through this video you are requested to please go through my channel and do subscribe my channel and also press bell button for notification of videos to be uploaded in future in this figure, a capacitor bank operating 20 MBR has been shown. Here, uh, mainly reactor has been shown. There are six reactor. That is, uh, 20 MBR capacitor bank is of double star connected for three phase uh, in each star. Uh, in each phase, there exists a reactor in series with the capacitor, uh, series parallel group combination. Therefore, six number of reactor is used. Now, how the capacitor unit are connected in series and parallel combination has been shown in this figure. In this figure, a uh, one phase of a one star connection has been shown. You can see there exist eight uh, capacitor in each phase of one star connection. Uh, four number of uh, four uh, capacitor are connected in parallel combination and again uh, number of four uh, connected in parallel combination these two parallel combination are connected in series combination in each phase of each in each star connection uh, here uh, the n city has been shown n city means neutral city it is called neutral city because uh, it is connected in between uh, the star point of the double star uh, connection of the capacitor bank that is why it is called neutral city now the schematic diagram for double star uh, capacitor bank for 20 ampere rating of voltage class of 33 kb system has been shown in this diagram you can see in each phases in each star connection there exist eight number of capacitor of which uh, there exist two series group and in each series group there exist four number of capacitor connected in parallel connection and each uh, phases of each star connection there exist a, a reactor and uh, in between neutral point of two star connection there exist a in city or neutral city and now uh, we want to uh, calculate the value of the capacitor unit of each uh, having a capacitance of C as uh, already I said that in each phase in each star there exist two series group and in each series group there exist two parallel group that is uh, in each series group four number of capacitor are connected in uh, parallel these two combination are connected in series group uh, th therefore in each uh, in each phase of in each star connection there exists eight number of capacitor in total there exist eight into six that is 48 number of capacitor unit in rating of 20 m here uh, capacitor bank now uh, we want to calculate for one star one phase uh, equivalent capacitance if uh, each unit capacitor is uh, value is C then uh, the equivalent uh, combination for four uh, unit in uh, parallel group come as uh, 4C and this uh, equivalent 4C capacitance value is connected in series uh, that is in uh, if two number of capacitor are connected in series of equal value then the equivalent uh, value will come into half and that is the equivalent uh, capacitance for each star in on phase comes as 2c and now the equivalent circuit for double star connection has been shown in this diagram here you can see that equivalent top in each phase in each star connection the equivalent capacitance is 2c and therefore this two uh, 
uh, to see of capacitance value is connected in parallel uh, therefore uh, the equivalent uh, circuit hydrogen shown in the right side of this diagram that is uh, in each phase equivalent capacitance comes as 4c now the rating of the capacitor bank is 20 ampere now here uh, capacitive uh, reactance that is xc per phase is equal to 1 by omega c here c is equal to 4c therefore the xc comes as per phase 1 by uh, omega into 4c per phase capacitive reactive power uh, is uh, equal to v phase uh, voltage square divided by xc for three phase the reactive power supplied by the capacitor bank is 3 into v phase uh, square by xc here phase voltage is line to line voltage divided by root 3 here line to line voltage is 33 kV therefore phase voltage comes as 33 divided by 1.732 kV therefore the equations comes as 3 into 33 divided by 1.732 uh, square into omega into 4c equal to 20 therefore 4 omega c comes as 0 0.01836 here omega is equal to 2 into pi into f f is the frequency of the system which is 50 hertz therefore omega comes as 314 by solving this equation we can calculate the value of the capacitors c which comes as c equal to 14.62 microfarad now what is the function of the reactor connected in series in each phase in each star connection uh, the diagram has been shown for in each phase on in each star connection of the capacitor unit in series with the uh, inductor whenever capacitor bank is switching on a huge inverse current will be flow um, from the circuit uh, due to presence of the capacitance to limit this in inverse current a series reactor has been in used uh, that is connected in series with the capacitor unit in each phase in each star connection now why series parallel combination is used instead of a single unit uh, now value of the capacitor of uh, each unit is uh, c equal to 14.62 microfarad now instead of uh, series parallel group we can use a single unit in each star connection that is uh, value of uh, 2c uh, that is uh, almost 29.24 uh, 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 microfarad uh, if if you use uh, um, value of 2c that is uh, c is equal to 14.62 microfarad what will happen that is if uh, any uh, failure occur in the in each unit which will leading to the complete shutdown of the capacitor bank and again whenever capacitor bank is switching on uh, on 33 kV system voltage uh, it will uh, supply capacitive um, current uh, capacitive current or leading uh, inject leading bar to the system to nullify the lagging bar in the system and to improve the power factor of the system the uh, capacitive current in injected for from each phases is equal to ic equal to 20 into 1000 divided by root 3 into system voltage that is 33 kv which is comes equal to 350 ampere per phase that is whenever switching in on of the capacitor bank in each phase uh, there will be a capacitive current of value of 350 ampere per phase therefore in each star connection the current uh, supplied per phase uh, will be equal to 175 ampere now 
for this uh, parallel and series combination each unit of the capacitor uh, capacitor unit will supplied uh, 43.75 ampere therefore each capacitor unit has to handle only 43.75 ampere current instead of 175 ampere current that is if a single unit use instead of uh, series and parallel group a single unit has to handle 175 ampere of current that is four times current has to handle that is designed of the capacitor unit will be more complicated compared to the uh, small un smaller unit also uh, due to maintenance purpose if failure occur for a single unit it will be easier to replace uh, the single unit without any outage of the capacitor bank now why the double star connection uh, of the capacitor bank instead of a single star if a single star connection is made instead of a double star connection uh, the faulty there is no uh, possible uh, possibility to detect the faulty unit of, of the capacitor bank here uh, two star point uh, has been formed in the double star unit in between the two star point a neutral city is connected uh, in normal condition that is under healthy condition uh, the star point of each star um, star connection is uh, is voltage is zero due to balance uh, current flowing in the each star formation of the capacitor unit if uh, capacitor unit of any star formation in any, any phase uh, degrade or fail then the capacitive reactance on that phase will change and leading to uh, flow of the current uh, unbalanced current flow in that star connection therefore um, there will be voltage difference in between volt point a and b and therefore a circulating current will flow in between a and b and in n city will sense this current the n city secondary is connected to a relay which is called neutral unbalanced current relay if uh, the setting provided in the uh, a neutral unbalanced current relay is more uh, than a alarm will uh, send to the operating personnel to detect uh, and, and to detect the faulty capacitor unit in the capacitor bank if uh, the current is more than the preset value then it will trip the capacitor bank uh, to allow uh, to avoid any outage of the capacitor bank so the function of the nct is to detect uh, any unbalanced current uh, due to uh, faulty capacitor unit in the capacitor bank now how the capacitor bank improve the power factor of the system now in the left side of the diagram before switching on the capacitor bank the power triangle has been shown here ql is the reactive power p is the active power and s is the apparent power and power factor is defined as the cosine between the angle uh, of p and s that is active power and apparent power or uh, also it can be defined as the ratio of the active power to the apparent power if uh, ql is equal to 19 or uh, nearby 20 megahertz then after switching on the capacitor bank it will completely nullify the uh, uh, lagging reactive part uh, that was earlier supplied um, by the system that is ql therefore the uh, the power factor angle comes to equal to close to zero and the power factor comes to close to unity that is how the power factor is improved by the switching on of the capacitor bank